What's going on, mother truckers? We're gonna show you this clip right here. This is a raw footage of a, basically the first self-driving semi truck that's following another truck. I know that sounds confusing, but basically this truck driver did 200 miles by driving and then having an autonomous truck behind him follow him. Mother truckers, let's get into this. This. So there's a company out here called Locomation and they're working with a lot of the big carriers, Wilson Logistics, Stevens Transport, and they're looking at using this technology in over 3,000 equipment. We're real customers who have signed up for our ARC systems. Wilson Logistics, PGT Trucking, Christensen Transportation, and Stevens Trucking. Now, here's the thing about it. They're not saying that they want to kick out the truck driver at all. They're saying that they want the truck driver to actually make more money. So this is the way they want to make it work. They want to do it almost like a relay race. They want two truck drivers, one in each truck, leave in the morning, let me paint the picture, and one driver's driving while the other one in the back following that semi-truck is sleeping. Our approach, what we refer to as human guided autonomy, keeps a skilled human operator in the lead of the two truck autonomous relay convoy. And after the 11 hours, the other truck driver that's sleeping will pass it through and then the other driver will rest and that semi truck will follow. The second truck follows autonomously with that driver resting off the clock. The convoy leaves the home hub, travels 500 miles to a second hub, swap trailers with another ARC team to advance the load, and then returns to their home hub being led by the second human driver who now leads the convoy while the first driver rests in the following truck. So it's almost like a, a, a baton pass. But the question I have is, would you feel comfortable, mother truckers, while someone's driving, you're sleeping in the other truck? I'm not sure how the technology works yet, but if that truck goes off a bridge, does the semi truck go off the bridge? You know, that's the question that I have for y'all. So, you know, the thing that they want to do is they want that driver and his driver in the back semi truck to get paid pretty much 22 hours, almost 24 hours days of work for doing one shift as a team. Mother Truckers, comment down below. What are your thoughts about this? You know, this company says they want to keep the driver in the truck. They want the truck driver to make more money. So here's the thing. If I'm driving the front truck and the truck behind is sleeping, do I get paid double for 11 hours? That's all I'm asking. Mother Truckers, comment down below. What are your thoughts about everything? But yeah, this is something that they're doing. This is the first ever, 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 ever of a truck driver driving pretty much two semi trucks for 200 miles allegedly successful so mud truckers comment down below let me know your thoughts are you excited about this are you not again they're saying that they don't want to kick the driver out they basically want two drivers instead of four to do teams in two trucks mud truckers comment down below what's going on mother truckers Hey, we chilling, man. Who we got here? All right, my name is, is Chevy. I go by the name Hilltop Chevy. I'm an entertainer, I'm an artist, and most, most of all, I'm a truck driver, going around delivering goods, man. I'm, hey, I ran into my guy, great guy, happy to see you, man, and keep doing what you're doing, man. We, we definitely watch you, we definitely watch you. Man, I didn't know we had so much talent out here. I mean, hey, uh, plug all your stuff, social media is everything, man. Oh, yeah, listen, so um, Instagram is at underscore one Chevy. Uh, TikTok at under, underscore the number one and then Chevy. We got Facebook and Chevy Hicks. And look, you gotta see the back of my truck. Look, look what I got back. The always advertising. Yeah, you see yeah. And, and for all the new drivers out here trying to stay successful in these hard times, any advice? Yeah, I would say just take your time, you know, and have a plan. As long as you got a plan, man, and just stick to it, it'll always go through. Take your time, have your plan, and keep pushing. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Every time. That's my logo, man. See, hold on. Let me show you my Let's logo. Go. Let's time. go. I don't know if you can see it. Yes, sir. It means like 
the, there's a three on the end, and the three represents consistency. You do it over and over and over again, no matter what, no matter how small it is, do it. Show up and show out every time. Beautiful energy. All y'all follow my man. Good seeing you, man. Come yes, on, uh, mother truckers. We chilling here. Who we with today? Carter. You know, uh, we were just hanging out at the truck stop. I seen you, so I had to say what's up. So, uh, how long you been trucking? About uh, three years. You know, what's the best advice for someone that wants in this game? Because this game is hard right now. Yeah, just uh, take it slow, take it easy, and just ride the wave. Take it in and uh, just kind of take all the advice you can, but stay true to yourself. I love that. I love that, man. Uh, what's your social medias, man? Shout them out. Yeah, there is. That's my Insta. Yeah. That's awesome, brother. That's that's beautiful. That's beautiful, man. I appreciate yeah, you. Right on, right on. Yeah, yes, man. sir. Yeah, pleasure, pleasure to meet y'all. And uh, very best luck to everybody in trucking. And let's get together. Let's get back back to uh, being commodity and helping each other out. I love this. Yeah. What we got going on here? We got shirts for 20. Yeah. We're hanging out. Yeah. Shout it out. What's up, man? How's it going? Yeah. It's perfect. Good. You know, I got to record this shirt right here. Don't turn around now. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah.